Jacob Colton. Good afternoon, Mr. Colton. Good afternoon. Sir, you've been charged with reckless driving a Class B misdemeanor. This is alleged to have occurred on or about July 17th of this year. You have the right to speak to a lawyer before we proceed. Did you wish to speak to a lawyer? No. This is the time set for a plea. Did you know how you'd like to plead to the matter? I would like to assert my right under Rule Number 10 to an information or indictment. I have my promise to appear of contract. The complaint by the officer. I haven't received any charges yet. The bottom in small print says it's not as information. No, I'm aware. So you're oh. just asking for a formal information in this case, is that? If they're going to pursue against me, I would need the formal information. But as far as I'm concerned, I haven't been charged, and this is my contract, and I've fulfilled my duty by appearing today. Okay, why don't you go ahead and have a seat, then the prosecutor should be here shortly. We'll see if, uh, if he's able to put together. Number one, obviously, you're, you're correct. It's go he's going to have to see if it's something he wants to pursue. If it is something he wants to pursue, I'm sure he'd be happy to prepare that information for you today. If it's my ask a question? Yes. Since I've shown, could he mail that to me if he wants to? Well, pursue? he should be here any minute, and so typically, so if you, if you want to just wait a few minutes, um, he should be able to get that to you today. Okay. Okay. I, if he's not here, you know, if he's running late or something, I'm not going to keep you here all afternoon. Okay. But um, where I see that he's going to be here very, very shortly, um, I don't think it's necessarily a problem. You let me know if I'm going to make you late for somewhere. I do, yeah. i got to be somewhere by 5. So. By 5? Oh, it's, no, we'll have you out of here plenty of time before okay. that. So, yeah, if you want to just have a seat for a minute and see if he wants to do a, a formal information, um, it seems to me then you'll know exactly what you're charged with. We could, I'm assuming um, that you'd like to plead not guilty if you do receive that formal information today, or did you want if to? If I do receive the information, I would like a reasonable time to come back on Thursday okay. so I can review it. Well, would you like me just to just continue this matter then and have the prosecutor review it then? And well, I wouldn't want to sign a promise to appear to an arraignment or a pretrial until I receive that. So. Okay, fair enough. Have a seat then. I'm going to give this back to you. Though. All right. Okay, so have a seat. We'll see if we can get the formal information. Then if, you, if you're if you in a position where you don't want to enter a plea until such time, you have time to review it and we can set it for a date specific for an arraignment. Then I think that would be probably the most prudent way to proceed. I agree. Okay, thank you. Have I agree. Seat.